The B-1B Lancer is a heavy bomber used by the United States Air Force. It has been nicknamed Bone. It is one of three strategic bombers serving in the U.S. Air Force fleet, along with the B-2 Spirit and the B-52 Stratofortress. The B-1 was originally conceived in the 1960s as a platform that would combine the Mach 2 speed of the B-58 Hustler with the range and payload of the B-52. It was intended to replace both bombers. However, the development program was plagued by cost overruns and technical challenges, and the B-1A program was canceled in 1977. The B-1B program was resurrected in 1981, and the first B-1B Lancer was delivered to the U.S. Air Force in 1985. The B-1B is a long-range, high-speed bomber that can carry a variety of conventional and nuclear weapons. It has a combat range of over 6,000 miles and can fly at speeds of up to Mach 1.25. The B-1B is a large, four-engine aircraft with a distinctive blended wing and body design. Then this bomber is equipped with variable sweep wings, also called swing wings. These wings can be swept back or extended to optimize performance at different speeds and altitudes. The B-1B is powered by four General Electric F-101 GE-102 turbofan engines, each of which can produce over 30,000 pounds of thrust. The B-1B can carry a maximum payload of 75,000 pounds of bombs, missiles, or other munitions. It can also carry a variety of electronic warfare and reconnaissance equipment. The B-1B is equipped with a defensive suite that includes radar warning receivers, chaff dispensers, and electronic countermeasures. The B-1B has been used in a number of combat operations, including Operation Desert Storm, Operation Enduring Freedom, and Operation Iraqi Freedom. It has also been deployed to support NATO operations in Europe. The B-1B is expected to remain in service with the U.S. Air Force until at least 2030. The Air Force is currently developing a number of upgrades for the B-1B, including a new radar system and a new electronic warfare suite. These upgrades are expected to keep the B-1B relevant and effective for many years to come. But there's a plan that might mean we never see the Lancer fly again. The B-21 Raider is reportedly a replacement figure for this Lancer. It is designed to be a more capable and adaptable, state-of-the-art aircraft that will gradually replace the aging B-1 Lancer and B-2 Spirit bombers now in service. While the B-21 isn't expected to be operational and introduced into service for several more years, the formal unveiling ceremony hosted by Northrop Grumman Corporation at its production facilities in California is a significant milestone in the Air Force's effort to modernize combat capabilities. Well, that's for today. I think we'll miss this amazing bomber in the future. Time to say goodbye. Thanks for watching and see you in the next turn.